That's what I'm going to use to make the gate, the guillotine gate, the framing for it anyway. And as you can see, I marked off three foot. I kind of jigged up because I don't have any of my chop saws hooked up. So I'm going to have to do this early caveman style with the cutoff saw. So here we go. Oh, I just love doing this. Look, I'm going to turn this off for a while. This is going to be a while. Okay, we're almost through. Awesome. One down, three more to go. Oh, early caveman stuff. Okay, that's number one. Here's um, number two. Okay, number three, getting there, let's see, here we go, all digged up, ready to cut for a while. Number three, one more to go. Oof. Unfortunately, this last piece of that is a little bent. So I'm gonna have to heat this up and straighten it out after I cut it. So let's get it set up to cut and then we'll go from there. Okay, number four. Now to straighten it out. To flat steel, not so flat steel. So let's try this before we start to break out the torch. That's good enough again for government work. Yep, man of steel stuff. Anyway, time to jig up and get this gate made. So it looks like the first thing we gotta do, I got some spots of weld on this table. 
if I'm going to jig up and make it square, I'm going to have to get them off of here. So let me get the table set up. It shouldn't take too long. A little bit of grinding. <laughs> 